obviously you know, it's been a big travel week for you guys, kind of had some things change up. Not only to get a ro road win, but get a win uh, at a clutch time of the season, what does that mean? Well, I, I think it was, it was big for our group. Uh, you know, we've been struggling a little bit and we haven't played uh, our best basketball, but uh, I thought tonight we were inspired by our, our defense and our defense uh, really led to productive offense. And, um, you know, that's the way we have to play going down the stretch. We have to be super solid on the defensive end and get some run out, some easy baskets. And I, I thought Scott Ethington tonight really came up huge every time. You know, uh, the College of Charleston made a run at us. You know, he, he answered with a big bucket. So we were very fortunate in that regard. It seemed like a strange first half. You know, you guys seemed to control it early. Then you look at the scoreboard, and it's, and it's a four-point difference. But second half, you know, as corny as it sounds, it looked like you guys played a, a little bit more complete as, as a team. You saw Reggie Spencer. You saw Walker. A couple of guys come sure. together. You know, I thought we missed a couple of layups early in the first half when we had a, a, a comfortable lead, and, and we allowed them to – climb back into the contest and in the second half I thought we did a better job of finishing around the basket. Well all roads lead to Baltimore hopefully ultimately uh, what does this road mean to you in terms of moving forward in terms of maybe you don't want to get caught looking at the standings but in terms of moving forward you, you know you no, want to keep moving up. Yeah you just want to keep improving you know and, you, and it was a big uh, confidence builder tonight uh, you know it's going to help our team going forward that you know we can play at a high level and, and you know March is just around the corner and you want to be hitting stride uh, by the time you, you, you get down to Baltimore. And, you know, I think the tournament's going to be terrific. I think people, if they come out to, to, to see it, they're, they're going to see some great basketball, some great great programs going head-to-head -head with everything on the line. There's nothing more exciting than that. I think if Etherton keeps getting any more double-doubles, it's going to be just him and Veteran just racing to get double-doubles all yeah, the time. Yeah, well, there's two two really good players. And, uh, you know, I don't know if people realize how difficult that is to do night in and night out when people are keying on you. but. Both those guys have, uh, have played really, really well all year, and they're proud of, I'm proud of Scotty's effort. All right, Coach, thanks. Best of luck moving forward. Thanks for having me.